Yeah. So, it's a little bit of cut meat. I think I love it. Yeah, I think yeah. I love yeah. too much yeah. cut meat in this. If we take some cut yeah. meat out of the thing, yeah. there it is. Thank you. Oh my God. Now you got, you got too much southern in it. If you take some southern out, I think. There it is. There it is. Thank you very much. Give it up for the amazing Amy again, everybody. Come on. And by the way, if you can bend like that. We'd like your number. Yeah, seriously. Your room number. We can't drive. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, we're coming to town. We won't let you down. I see a frown. Let's turn it around. We're the Slomsky Brothers. You all know what to do. We're the Slomsky Brothers. You bring good time to you. Our suits are rolled, but our tunes are really new. We're the Slomsky Brothers. So many of you tonight. Yeah, we've we've gone out there. You guys are a great crowd. We're loving this already. So that way, if someday we ever take a trip somewhere, or a train trip, or a plane trip, or whatever, we might meet some of you. What are you, what are you talking about? What are you, you talking about? about? What are you talking? About? We don't travel. We don't travel enough. We hardly ever go anywhere. That's all we. That's all we really do is travel. Like for instance, when did we travel? Well, uh, this morning we were in Richmond, and yeah. then this afternoon we were in Baltimore. And right, and Philly. Sure, sure. That's all work stuff, though. That's all work related. I mean, just a vacation. We just go somewhere and hang out. Well, actually, I want to know what these people are talking about. I want to know what they're hey, talking hey, about. Let's take one right back here. here. What are you guys talking, talking about? about all sorts of things. This seems like a party. There, I think there's Is this a table? Are you guys having a good time? I'm having a great time. Talking to the bald guy. Oh, I'm pointing your ass, dude. Talking to everybody. Yeah, I'm, I'm saying we travel all the time. Like what? What travel. are you talking about? We travel all the time. This is what we do for a living. We travel all the time. Right. I'm hearing you say that, but I haven't heard any evidence to speak of. Uh, how about the time we went tomorrow? We went tomorrow? Yes, we went tomorrow. We never went tomorrow. Uh, yeah, we did. About a year ago. A year ago, we went tomorrow. A year ago, uh, you're thinking Topeka. No, we went tomorrow this time. Nah, I don't recall going tomorrow. Yeah, we went tomorrow. No, I don't think so. Maybe you're thinking Toledo. No, we went tomorrow this time. I don't think we went tomorrow. We went tomorrow. You want to bet on it? All right. Yeah, I'll bet on it. All right. Gentleman's bet. A gentleman's bet. How's this work? I'm saying we never went tomorrow. And I'm saying we did go tomorrow. And if I'm right, then this Which half of the not. room, you know, buys us drinks. Don't worry. <laughs> I'm right, so you're not going to have to buy us So if you're right, this half of the room buys us drinks. And I'm sorry about that, but you're going to have to buy us some drinks. Well, that's so all we went tomorrow. Say, that's we never went tomorrow. I, I, we play a song. I know we play a song about it. Alright, you know what, let's just play the song. Why don't we just play the song? I started on a journey just about a year ago To a little town tomorrow in the state of Ohio I hadn't traveled much, but I really didn't know The bar was the hardest place I'd ever try to go So I went to the station for my ticket and a fly Tips regarding tomorrow, not expecting to be guile I said, my friend, I'd like to go tomorrow So go ahead, ladies and gentlemen, my brother, Bill Slomsky, as the ticket taker. Are you ready? I've been ready since we started. Okay. Tickets, please. Hand me your tickets, please. If you're going on the train, you need a ticket. What are you, what are you doing? I'm being the ticket taker. I'm kind of, I mean, I'm, it's like 5 o'clock. I'm kind of we're singing my a song. Up, like gotta, a gotta, we're going to sing a song. you got to sing. Oh, you got to sing the part of the ticket taker. Yeah, I gave you an opportunity. Hey, I'm going to go ahead and take responsibility for that. Let's go ahead and we'll try it again. I'll try to sing. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, take two. My brother singing this time as a ticket taker. Got it. You ready? I started that. Okay. Tickets, please. Bring me your tickets, please. Oh, my God. Where's your tickets, please? Baby, baby, tickets, please. Tickets, please. Bring it up. What do you got to say? Let tickets, please. What do you got to Where are you doing? I thought we were singing a song. Here, I'm getting into it. You're not doing anything. I should have been more clear. This might have been my fault. You see how I sang a story that started it? Oh, yeah. That was I would like you to do the same. Well, I don't know the story. 
I was getting kind of funky. But I was actually really funky. Oh, thanks. Yeah, I've been working on my. But what? Can you make something up? That would be good. All right. I tell you what. You do a little bit, sing a little bit, and then I'll jump in on like an intro. Yeah, like an intro. Give me a little. You know. I can do that for you. Ladies and gentlemen, dances. Take three. Up on tickets, please. My brother, Bill Slonsky, is the ticket taker. So you go ahead, and when you stop, I'll just jump in. You a little intro. All right. Thanks, Slonsky. Said he to me. Much of an intro. That's like four words. That's that's all, I already sang my part. I already sang my part. So I don't have any that's time to make it up. That's what you got. So I got that's to, what you I got. Gotta make it up on the planet. Yes. On the planet. Yes. Make it up. Yeah. All right. I don't even know what this is. Four times. I don't even remember what the song is. Actually, you know what? Forget four. Last chance. Ladies and gentlemen, my brother singing a story that he's making up. Yes. On the Are you ready? To me, then to see if I can hurt you right. You want to go tomorrow and return tomorrow night. You should have gone tomorrow, yesterday, and not today. But the chain that goes tomorrow is the mile of all you see. You have gone tomorrow, yesterday, and I don't see. You could have gone tomorrow and return today and three for the three to do tomorrow. Yet the schedule is right. Today is just tomorrow and return tomorrow. And three. That's great. You know, that's actually exactly what he said. Kind of a high tenor. Yeah, and he sang in rhyme. It was really weird at the time, but I just wanted to go tomorrow. So I said, I'd like to go tomorrow. Can I go today? Get tomorrow by tonight if there is no delay. And then he said to me, Then I've got no more to say. How can you go anywhere tomorrow and return again today? Actually, sorry about that. You guys know some drinks, yeah, so... Thank you. Uh, Go ahead, I'll take a whiskey. Yeah, I drink whiskey, too. It's a little chaser of whiskey. Yeah, actually, speaking of that, Phil Slotsky, I'm, I'm feeling a little off. Oh, no. You feeling bad? Yeah, you know, I woke well, up this morning, and I, I, I didn't feel very well. And, and I'm sorry, you know, it's my fault, ladies and gentlemen. You know, we had a big show, and I'm sorry that I don't... I'm a little off, so... You're I'm a little good. off, but that's okay. You know what? I just read something yesterday. I was reading something. You were actually reading. Well, I was uh, yeah, skimming. And this isn't a comic book. Yeah, it was a, no, it wasn't a comic book at all. There was no part of one of some pictures in like the kind of But it, uh, there was a, it was called Dr. Ink for Dummies. And I read it pretty much the whole way through, and now I think I can help you out. If you're feeling bad, that's the whole idea. This is probably not going to go over. Right? Well, you're the perfect specimen, Dr. Ink for right, Dummies. I'm willing to try this out. So you read a book. Yeah, so you... the first thing is you ask a bunch of questions and ask them how they're doing. So like, for instance, name. No, my name is Okay, so we can skip that one. All right, sex. Right, none. Okay, why don't we just skip to like the second chapter of a question? Oh, uh, and it has to do with symptoms. Did you have any symptoms? Have yeah, symptoms? I, I woke up this morning and I was a little, I, was, I had a headache. That was uh, the first thing I had a headache. You woke up with a headache? Yeah. That's easy. That's easy. It's scurvy. No, because long it's not scurvy. Well, how do you know it's not scurvy? I drink plenty of margaritas. That's a good point. Yeah. All right, well, what, what maybe some other symptoms? I was a little woozy. I like got up and I was a little got up over. in the morning. It was a headache and he had a woozy. Oh, Mark, you're pregnant. Maybe you're pregnant. That's what you get in your I'm not pregnant. Oh, oh yeah, good question too. I remember. All right, maybe there was some other symptoms. Did you have? Uh, I was woozy and I, I like I almost kind of lost my lunch. I was like, it was the pizza from late. You don't need doctor like, for dummies for this. I think you had a hangover. That does not sound familiar. A hangover. It's like when you drink way too much. I know what a hangover is, Phil. I'm saying that that does not sound familiar to me. Yeah, well, I think it might have been a hangover. There's only one cure for that. With the hair of the dog. You gotta have another drink. I don't know. I've been drinking. I don't think I, you know, I... I well, how much did you drink? No idea. How do you not know how much you drink? I was drinking. Well, that's a good point. <laughs> well, how many, you know, what did you start drinking? Uh, about nine. Nine o'clock, you started drinking, so you drank for like three hours, four hours straight. That's nothing. It was nine in the morning. Wow. Wow. That's 
take a drink. amount of drinking for well, you. know, that's what we do. I tell you what, it's simple. How many drinks does it take for you to get drunk? Oh, that's easy. Just one. One drink gets you drunk? Just one. I don't believe it. It's just it's the truth. I don't know. One it's drink gets you drunk. drunk. Yeah. I don't know if it's the 13th or the 14th. I think it's time, I, I tell you what, there's one cure for the head. What's that? It's, like I said, if you have another drink, I bet oh, like, oh, you know what we should drink? Like Shirley Temple. No yeah. offense to the guy in the kilt, but am I wearing a dress? <laughs> Alright, what I'm saying is I don't want that. Alright, you don't want a Shirley Temple. How about no. a, a wine spritzer? Again, no. Okay, how about a margarita? No, we're not on the beach. Which one? Yeah. You know, you know what I want? want? You know what I want? the one drink that gets me going. Is that right? Yep. Safety should be first. Yeah. 
right? Fine. Yeah, Safety like, first. Practice. Why the hell are you juggling knives near me? Oh, I told you not to do that. I couldn't find my balls. <laughs> All right, you have just brought the show down. Yeah. It, like, the show was up here. Amazing Andy was up here. Well, I thought right. juggling knives would be kind of neat. Look. Tell you what, you know what? How about this? I wrote a song about you. You wrote a song about me? Yeah, when I was sleeping in the van, I wrote a song about you. Okay, you wrote a song when you were sleeping? Yes. That makes no sense with it. Well, why would it? With you, Phil Slomsky, of course, it would not make any sense. Right. So yeah. let's hear the song. Well, I, I didn't teach it to myself yet. Okay, you learned the song. No, I didn't say I learned it. I said I wrote the song in my mind when I was okay. sleeping. How the hell are these people supposed to hear this song? Well, I, I'll just play it on something else. I just have to turn it on this. I'll show you. All right, what are you going to all right, so you're not going to play it on the pan, you're going to play it on something else. Yeah, I'm going to play it on this. <laughs> I don't know, it fell off the van. Oh, oh no, it fell off like two weeks ago. Yeah. St. Louis. We haven't used it at all. You know what, so just go. Want to hear the song? Yeah. All right. You're not hot, even though you might think you are, said you're not hot, even though you might think you are, said you're not hot, even though you might think you are, said you're not hot, even though you might think you are. Bum, 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 bum,
actually got these uh, when I was traveling across the country. You were traveling across the country? Yeah. And actually, you know, you were in the van. Oh yeah, I remember when we went to Salt Lake City? Yes. Do you remember that? Yes. That was a party. Nobody parties like the Mormons. No, there's nobody parties like the Slavs. Except the ex-Mormons. Actually, you know what? Remember when I lost my suit? Yes. Awkward. <laughs>
take it away. I, was I didn't say take it away at all. I didn't say take it away. What are you doing? You said take it away. No, I didn't ruin the song. Actually, you interrupted said, my solo. No, I didn't interrupt your solo. I interrupted that. It's different. I just, besides, I said cake it away. I said, hey, cake it away, Marislavski. <laughs> yeah, I said cake it away. Can I get a second chance? Can oh, I? sure. All right. Mark Slanky. Yeah, there's 